Hi guys, this is a short tutorial to show you how to uninstall apps on macOS. So if you're coming from Windows, you know that uninstalling apps on Windows is pretty easy. There is just one place where you can manage all the apps and uninstall it from there. Unfortunately, on Mac, it's not so easy, but there are some ways that we can work around it. So by default, if you want to remove an app from Mac, you go to Finder then to applications and here you have all the apps installed on your Mac and from here you can just click and move to bin but as you know some of the applications have some additional files and this method will leave these files untouched so they will still take up your space so one way to remove all of these files is to look for the application that you want to remove, for example, Spotify. Search on the whole Mac. Here, click this plus button. Here, select other. Type system files and select it to show in the menu. Click OK. Then select system files here and here select are included. That way you should see all the files that are connected to this app and you can just select them and move them to bin. The other way, which is a bit easier and does not require from you to do this all the time with every application is to use an external app. So for example, you can just remove the apps the standard way by moving to the bin without doing any additional work. And then you can use external application to remove the remaining files. For example, Cleaner One Lite. This is a free software. I'm guessing since this is a light version, there's also some premium version, but this one is sufficient. So when you open this software, you can just run the scan. And here in the section on the left, you see an installed application leftovers. And here by default, you see all the remaining files from the applications that you already deleted. So if you remove Spotify or some other app, but you just removed it from applications without removing any additional files, it will show up here. And here you can just select these leftovers and remove them. So it's that simple. And I think it's much more convenient than do it, doing it manually. So I would recommend this way. I hope this was helpful. If yes, please hit the like button and thank you for watching.